Hi guys, I am Suprabha. In this video, we will see the examples asked in GATE in the year 16 for ME. So, the first example is, solution of system of equations is, they have given this and we have supposed to find out the value of x and y. So, we will form the two equations. Now these are two simultaneous equations. We will multiply first equation by 2. So adding both the equations we get. So the value of y is minus 2. We will substitute in the first equation. So, the value of x is equal to 6. x is 6, y is minus 2. So, option D is correct. 6 minus 2. The next example, condition for which the eigenvalues of matrix A is equal to 2, 1, 1, K are positive is. And they have given the condition for K. Now, we know that determinant of A, one of the property of eigenvalues state determinant of a is equal to product of eigenvalues now they have stated that eigenvalues are positive so we can see that product will be positive so the determinant is 2k minus 1 is greater than 0 positive means will Put the condition that it should be greater than 0. So, the value of k is k should be greater than half. So, the option A is k is greater than 1 by 2. So, option A is correct. The third example real square, square matrix A is called as q symmetric if and they have given 4 options. Now we know the definition of skew symmetric that any matrix, any square matrix is called as skew symmetric if A is equal to minus of A transpose. Now if you see all the options, this we can write it as A is equal to, sorry, minus A is equal to A transpose that is option C is correct. The last example. Number of linear independent eigenvectors of matrix A is. Now, the given matrix is of order 3 into 3. As the matrix is upper triangular matrix, we can directly conclude that the three eigenvalues are 2, 2, 3. Because we know if the order is 3 into 3, there will be three eigenvalues and three eigenvectors for each eigenvalues. Now, For these two eigenvalues, we will get the same eigenvector. So, we can say that the two eigenvectors will be linearly independent. So, the answer is 2. Thank you guys. Thank you for watching my video. Hope you understood the concept. For handwritten notes, just check out the link in video description. For any doubts and suggestions, please let me know in the comment box. There are few videos that you can refer. Guys, help us to help you. So please like and share my video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you.